There's several different types of frame machines. Today, we get to use another one. Me and Bob, we're gonna straighten this truck out. I don't have any music for this. Anyway, let's go. 2019 Volvo VNL 760. Customer states that he was in an accident. Now, down through here, Bob's gonna point out our gauges here. Check this out, all right. So, and they stuck us on this other frame machine here, so. This gauge here was down, we're up now, but you can see all the way to the back there, it's kind of shiny. The lighting in this shop is a little rough at the moment, but we've got to pull it over right now and you can see how far we've got to pull past, probably about uh, four inches there. Let's check out this other machine here, huh? Check it out. Car, frame machine, tower, another tower. Cool machine. And, oh, Betsy here. Anyway, let's let off on her and see what happens. Bob, you wanna push that? No. Right there. Oh yeah, there we go. Let's let off the other side. Dun, 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 dun. All right, I gotta give you a little help, huh, Bob? All right, there we go. Bam! Ah, let's see if we're past. We're not past. Oh, there we go. So this type of machine is a little bit different. So what we got here is we have to chain it down in the back back here. So that way she doesn't move, right? And then we're going to pull because she, the front end was pushed over and they noticed that the hood wouldn't line up correctly. So we gauged her out. Then we pulled this way where this cross member was. And we come over here and we pulled opposite on the front and pulled her over. Now, we have moved her about two and a half inches. And this is a fairly new truck, really nice truck, low miles, was in a minor accident. But, as you can see here, uh, let's see, I can't really get a good glimpse down the line here, but we're pretty straight up right now. We need to be just past with this pin. Because when you take off and drive down the road, the frame's gonna shake and it's gonna go back a little bit. Because these frames are extremely flexible. A lot of people don't realize that. Frames are flexible, right? All right, on to the high-speed montage, and hopefully we get some good music so we can uh, not violate community standards or have a copyright. Like that now we look and we're just slightly past with this one right here just past so what's gonna happen is, is we're gonna back this thing off drive it around the block and bring it back and the frame is gonna flex around and settle back down again now it could go back but it won't go back as far but we are bending or straightening we don't bend we straighten other people bend but we are straightening the frame out right but we have to um, bend the frame in certain places to relieve stress from where the bends are to straighten the frame. All right, so we got her straightened out. Let's check these gauges out. Do a little, uh, do a little videography here. So, as you can see, we're all straightened out here. All three, well, can't do that. All the gauges are out. There we go. 